just wanna go fast Hold on my teeth and on my neck And I'm stone cold with the flex Back again with another quick video All my videos are gonna be quick from now on I have a hard time going through, uh, sitting through a 15, 20 minute video, let alone editing one. So just finished drinking my pre-workout, sitting in the parking lot to the gym, and I figured I'd ask another subscriber question. The question was, what do I look for in a channel if I'm looking to subscribe to a channel? What is it that I'm looking for? And I thought that was a really interesting question. It's not really fitness related, uh, more YouTube related which is what we're all doing. So figured I'd just breathe some life into that. When I look for a channel, I look, I'm constantly every day looking for new um, creators to follow. So if you're brand new and you've never subscribed to my channel before, drop a link in the comments below and I'll check out your videos. Um, and this is exactly what I'm looking for. I want a channel, I want to be entertained more than anything, um, but I also want to learn. So basically I want a well-rounded channel. I want some education, I want some entertainment, uh, good music, things like that. And one thing I don't want to see, I like edits just as much as every other person, but there's only so much slow motion one person can take. If I'm watching a video and it's six minutes long, Every video six minutes long and one of the minute of the six minutes is just slow motion lat pull downs and plate stacks moving. I'm out. <laughs> I can't handle it anymore. It was interesting in the beginning, but I just feel like it's getting really, really old and overdone. So I do like them every once in a while, but every edit is almost the exact same and it's just not entertaining to me anymore. Also, food. I am a huge foodie. I love food. I live to eat. I've been... If your channel has recipes, nutrition tips, macro tips, uh, if you're showing me different snacks, things that I can incorporate into my life, um, that's perfect. I absolutely love that stuff. I absolutely love food, so I want to see some food. I want to see some workout footage, and I'm not talking about like preacher curls and things like that there's all kinds of channels out there right now uh power lifting shogun strength is another channel i'm following and really digging there's three channels i'm going to mention right now that i feel are very well rounded um where you learn things you're entertained there's good music um and they're probably my three favorite channels to watch right now one matt lee uh, i think it's matt lee fitness check him out very good channel uh, he just finished competing which interests me because I learn about like peak week and things like that some of the food that he's eating uh, his training uh, and when he steps on stage he's like a fucking box of shreddies he's just striations and feathers everywhere so he looked amazing and really digging the music he puts on to his videos his workout footage is really good He's got drone footage. Uh, he's just a very well-rounded channel. I personally thought he would have like thousands of subscribers, and I'm sure it's coming. Um, but very good channel. Matt Lee Fitness, very good. Grey Wolf Fitness, everybody knows who Craig is from Grey Wolf Fitness. Very good channel as well. Um, he's funny and entertaining. He's an absolute savage when he works out and he's got his own setup in his basement which i've always wanted so every time in the videos that i'm watching of his i'm always looking around to see what he has and he has just about everything he's got more than most gyms have so absolutely love his channel as well and he's also one of the biggest supporters to the smaller channels so if you don't know who gray wolf fitness is uh check him out very good channel third one is shogun strength which I believe he's over in the UK. He must be power lifter. He's got really cool edits, transitions. He puts really good music in. It's almost Casey Neistat like, but in a fitness element, which I really like. He's smart. Um, he trains hard. Like the training footage as well. So those are three channels right now: uh, Matt Lee Fitness, Gray Wolf Fitness, and Shogun Strength. The three that I click on every one of their videos that come out. So, hopefully that answers your question, and I guess that's kind of a shout-out video as well for those three channels, which is awesome. My pre-workout is absolutely running through me right now, so I'm sweating like crazy. But, 
this is what I'm looking for in short term. I want to be educated. I want to learn something new, a new exercise that I haven't done before. I've been training for 10 years and I've got so many more exercises out there that I've never tried before or maybe a refresher on an exercise I haven't done in a long time um, that I can incorporate into it. Um, working out kind of gets stale sometimes. We do repetitive exercises over and over again. So if you can remind me of an exercise I haven't done in a while, that would be perfect. Um, nutrition, food, you got me at pizza, you got me at burgers. So I want to be educated, I want to be entertained, I want to see some good music, not always EDM. I want to hear some metal, I want to hear some rock and roll. Diversity with the music is important. I love looking at other gyms too. I've always wanted to be a gym owner, uh, eventually someday I will. And I just want to see... Shout out to Bradley Martin, he's not going to watch this video, but if you have not seen Zoo Culture, his gym that he just opened, holy shit, it's beautiful. I uh, said he put 300 grand into it, which in Canadian dollars is about 500,000, but it looks like Disneyland for a fitness junkie. So hopefully that answers your question. I am just rambling on right now because the pre-workout is going strong. I hope you're having a beautiful day hitting the weights and we'll see you in the next video. Keep those questions coming. Peace.